What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the channel. Man, normally I try to stay positive, but man, this is disgusting. This person here is disgusting. And he is, if you don't know who he is, this is Pablo Hidalgo. He's a high executive at Lucasfilm, right? He's a high executive at Lucasfilm. And I saw this go down on Twitter. Um, and he begins to make fun of and mock people that had a reaction to Luke Skywalker in The Mandalorian. Why? Maybe because he was more interested in Luke's reaction, people's reaction to The Last Jedi, the, the Disney sequels. Maybe maybe because he's jealous of the, of, you know, the Mandalorian's so-called success in Star Wars. I don't know what it is, but when you are at this level of Lucasfilm making fun of fans because they were happy to see Luke Skywalker. It, it just shows what Lucasfilm is. It, it just shows what Lucasfilm is. Listen, I, again, love or hate the scene, whatever it is, but I'm just saying, you don't do this. You have to be better. It, it, it is disgusting. It is disgusting. I, again, I saw this go down on Twitter. Whatever, However you feel about Star Wars Theory, that's your business. But it could have been any one, any one of us, especially someone from my video as well. This person posted this video. It uh, talks about Star Wars theory, reacts to Luke Skywalker scene. He shed tears, just like a lot of other people did. All right. Um, he's talking about, uh, I feel compelled to have an emotional reaction to Star Wars. By all means, have one. Hell, I almost cried at Crate. <laughs> hey, man, it is what it is. And, you know... And then Star Wars theories like, huh, Pablo Hidalgo is chiming in on this thread, which is making fun of me for being emotional over Luke Skywalker. Again, Star Wars theory wasn't the only one. He's like, I don't mind trolls, but I can't, um, but I can't see what he said. And I'd hate to believe that he would join in as a Lucasfilm official. Can someone please send screenshots? Well, there it is. Emotions are not for sharing. Um, someone so high out of the Star Wars theory is like, that's really crappy of him to, to, uh, to see, um, that someone's like who dedicates their life to Star Wars channel and stuff and having a positive reaction to a childhood hero, Pablo thinks it's funny. He thinks it's funny. Um, he thinks it's funny. Yeah, here it is. Pablo chimes in to make fun of me, deletes the tweet, then puts one of them as his header. How is this ex acceptable from someone so high up at Lucasfilm? You're telling people it's not okay to have emotions about the work your company produces, and you make fun of them for crying? It's not okay. There, that's what he said. That was the tweet. And there it is. Making fun of everyone who shed a tear. Um... <laughs> unbelievable again this is my video too of of men having reactions with their children positive reactions overseeing their childhood hero the way it's supposed to be seen and people at lucasfilm are laughing at this and you want us to take you uh, take it seriously my goodness I, i'm i'm shocked here i was defending here I was defending Lucasfilm to, to so many. And, and you're going to do something like this, Pablo? You, you, you're going to laugh? And, and how many others are laughing at uh, people having an uh, emotional reaction at Lucasfilm? You know? It's just disgusting behavior. And then you want us to sho shovel down more pride. Listen, man, I, I did. For seven minutes, I love seeing Luke Skywalker. I loved it. I'm not going to lie. I support Gina Carano. I will watch the show because I support Gina Carano. I love Gina Carano. But you're going to throw stones at people for having a reaction. It's truly disgusting. And, and you just think that it's just going to go unnoticed and that like we, it's just. I, I, and this is why. <laughs> I feel so stupid now because this is why I fought so hard against certain things that happened at Lucasfilm. You just guys, you guys just have it a mess. It's all a mess over there. I mean, you had authors that people that were writing books throwing shade at Gina Carano, and you and and you know, like, what kind of a 
messy company do you have now? Now this is unacceptable. This is a joke. This is a joke. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I, I, I'm just, I'm shocked. Something should not be left said. And then say behind a locked Twitter, you know, because you think no one will see and you just don't care. You don't care about the fans. I, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Um, this is the state of Lucasfilm. This is why most of the stuff you produce is crap. This is why people aren't buying your toys. Um, this is, I mean, this is why uh, people are talking out against Disney Star Wars. And you gave us a seven-minute moment where many people, not everybody, not everybody, never said Star Wars was saved, came together and shared a moment, and you want to spit in our face, Lucasfilm? <sighs> it's unbelievable. You're going to spit in the face of Star Wars theory? Like I said, love him or hate him, whatever. Um, <laughs> the biggest Star Wars YouTube channel out there, you're going to spit in his face too, Lucasfilm? The guy who promotes your product? The guy who... <laughs> I, I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Uh, I don't get it. I don't get it. Um, I, I don't get it. It's disgusting behavior. Um, let me know what you think. You'd be like, Jay, it's just a joke. Calm down. I get it, man. There's jokes that can be made. But when you're an executive from Lucasfilm and you have, you know, a position of power in a company, you know what I'm saying? Making fun of fans, even if you think it's just a joke, you, you have to be smarter than that. You have to be smarter than that. You can't be that dumb. You just can't be that dumb. You, you just can't be that dumb. Anyway, um, that's the video. Let me know your thoughts. Here we go again. <laughs> Here we go again. Good job, Pablo. Good job. Good job. Thanks for uh, snuffing out any hope. Um, thank God for Gina Carano. It's the, only, it's the only thing I got left at Star Wars. Uh, yep. Yeah.